welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you what I got at Dollar Tree this week. So if that's something you want to see, then just stick around. So we are getting into the second week of March here, and although Easter is in the middle of April, I believe this year, I am looking for the Easter objects and items, I guess, for my Easter baskets, and I'm really excited that I thought of these cute ideas for Leo's Easter basket. Leo is only one and a half, but I think he is um, gonna love these items because he's my only kid. I have to spoil him while he's little, okay? So to start out, I'll show you my favorite item that I got, and it's not even for me, but that's okay. So I got this mint turquoise colored broom and a dustpan, and it's connected right there. It just says mini kitchen broom and dustpan playset, ages three and up, and they had this color and a hot pink color, but this is gonna be great for Leo's Easter basket because it's colored like a pretty spring color, but he loves watching me do things and helping me clean with my broom but this time he has his own broom and maybe I'll even put like a little um write his name on there or something he is gonna love this another thing he likes to help me do is to cook he's getting to that age where he sees me do things and wants to be an adult like me as well so he wants to get up on the counter and help me but some of the items are just too dangerous so I got him this kitchen play set cooking fun and it comes with a banana orange lemon and a pepper or something and a cute little shopping basket he also loves putting things in baskets and flipping it over his shoulder and um, shopping around the house so he's gonna love this and then another item of the food I found these kitchen play set and it just comes with like some chicken wings some hot dogs some french fries ketchup and a cup of coca-cola and I got this one because this is like my favorite food and Leo's favorite food. He loves some french fries and chicken nuggets and ketchup. He likes to dip things in ketchup so I thought he would have fun pretending to eat those and he can start learning um, how to play pretend more and learn his colors. And then to cook those foods with I got him these utensils and it comes with a little plastic knife, a whisk, um, a fork, a little spatula and a spoon, a ladle, all those cute things you get like six in there oh eight pieces so he's gonna have fun mixing this stuff up and um, I love the cooking theme and cleaning theme because you know what little kids and little boys need to learn how to cook too. cook and clean it is not just the mamas out there another Easter item I got for Leo I got these last year as well but I've lost all of them or have just thrown them away out of annoyance <laughs> but there are the Easter eggs ten pieces and they are the cutest little animals so there's 10 in here and he is gonna love these. I'm gonna test it out and see if he's actually gonna find the eggs this year. But that, these are just so cute. And then there was another kind. I actually already opened it up so that Leo could play with it. But it had a tiger in it, a zebra, an elephant, a hippo, and this little like Boston Terrier ones but I would say that my favorite one right now is probably the koala because they're so cute and then they had so much new uh, home decor at the Dollar Tree and I was so excited to find these things because I'm trying to kind of redo my kitchen decor in black and white and red here and there also like farmhouse obviously but I thought this would be perfect it says bless this kitchen and it's just a basic frame but it has the mason jar outline there and I thought I could like make my own whoop, my own frame into this or something maybe make it wider or do something else with this because I love the black and white effect and then I love the paneling wood right there it's just a printout obviously but it says freshly baked with love I love to bake and cook my last name is Baker so it's appropriate right and this is black and white so I thought those two next to each other would be so cute somewhere. Sorry, my light is so bright. In my living room, I have like natural greens and earth tones in there and I thought this would be so cute because I love wreaths and I love faith and having faith and just love this because there's a lot of trials in my life right now, in my family's life. And I think it's really important if we just have faith and um, know that things will work out. So I love that, it's canvas, it has the wreath around it, very spring and fresh looking. And then I got this one for my bathroom and it's another canvas sign and it doesn't have any words on it but it has a little um, 
what color is that? Oh, my hair's on it. <laughs> That's gross. Maybe like a light blue, ocean blue with the clawfoot tub, which I've always secretly wanted. I want a huge one. And like bubbles popping up right there. I thought that'd be so cute because my bathroom is teal and yellow. And then I already opened these, but I am obsessed, okay? I took the tag off, but these are the fur flops. Oh yeah, these are like not bad at all. They're kind of flimsy, you know, they're kind of flimsy. But for a dollar, they are so stinking soft, cute, hot pink. And they're not bad. Like, I lost one of my slippers. So last night, when I went to Dollar Tree, I just tried this one out to see how they would be. Because I might want to get these for an Easter basket or a Mother's Day basket. Like, isn't that so cute? And I was just cooking dinner in them and kind of walking around the tile. Because the tile in my house is so cold. And there's like, I'm not going to sweep every day. So yeah, there's crumbs on the floor or like melted ice that, um... Daniel refuses to pick up but these were perfect I just walked around a little bit and now they're kind of torn up a little bit but I thought those were so cute for maybe a Mother's Day gift or an Easter basket then I got some boring household items but I was really in need of these I got these Surefresh 50 pack zipper sandwich bags I love using these for leftovers or packing snacks in Leo's lunchbox or diaper bag and then this one had a different seal on it. If you can tell, there's like a green seal, and this one is clear. This one has 45 in it, so I was risking the five less just to see how strong these are because sometimes these will fall apart. But I always buy my Ziploc baggies at Dollar Tree because there's a lot in here and way more than, uh, way less than what you'd pay for at Walmart. Then I got another Easter item to do some crafting with, and it's just this 12 piece of the foam eggs. I'm gonna put these in my little floral wreath. Then my little niece, Rosie, um, she has really bad baby eczema and sorry, my hair is like really annoying me. So the doctor said she can only use this Dove Sensitive Skin Bar Soap and it's fragrance free hypoallergenic beauty bar and it's a 2.6 ounces and they sell this at Dollar Tree. So I went ahead and got her some of that so her mom can try that out on her. She's doing a lot better since her mom started getting rid of like scented perfumes and laundry detergent but oh man it just looks so bad then these are my tried and true dishwasher pods they are the ultra shine dish detergent packs in the 10 count i always get two of these when i go in there because my sisters are asking me um do you have any dishwasher pods in your stockpile and i'm like yeah but i want them so i always get two now and then I got the Refresher Car Vent Clip in the Fresh Strawberry Scent. I love this flavor. I mean, this brand. Um, I got one in like a lim vanilla cinnamon or something. It smelled just like pumpkin pie. So I use that in the fall time and it's very strong. So I'm excited about this one. Hopefully smelling these summer scents will bring summer into my uh, state. So that was it for my Dollar Tree haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Let me know what your favorite item was this week. Mine was the broom and dust pan. I almost got one for myself, but I just don't think it's actually going to work very well with the bristles being too far apart. But this is an awesome Easter basket gift. Uh, just stick right up in there and look nice and nice quality. That was my favorite item this week. What was yours? How are you enjoying your week? If you live somewhere that's more than 50 degrees, please adopt me and my family. We would love to live with you because I'm tired of living in this Wisconsin Green Bay and Arctic, even though I live in the Midwest. <laughs> it should be like 60 to 70 degrees by now, but it's March 8th and it's 23 degrees. So thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already because I'd love to have you here, a part of my family here on YouTube. I make Dollar Tree videos, couponing, and mommy lifestyle videos. So thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.